Hello, guys. Hey, welcome Beautiful back. Out. <laughs> We're back, and it's looking really bright. It's not like it's morning. It's actually regular day now. I can fully see what's going on. Doesn't look like a yellowy tinted mess. Oh God! I can speak clearly now. And he was apparently out having fun as well. Why the? What's wrong with these people? Well, we have our water, Jim, so you know what to deal with. Have your electric or grass types ready, because we're going to be battling Misty again. Yep. But first, Violet. Alright, so... Yep. It's all Violet. So, anyway. in between, um... In between the, the uh, two episodes here, that the previous one and what we're recording now, I did actually look up the, uh... Officially... Well, from Spoken, technically, but the way I'm looking at it is through Showdown, because they use the Spoken, uh, build as the, as the basis for what they do for teams and all that. What their, what their rulings are, and like what, like the clauses are in effect, and what, what's, um, what's allowed and what's not. Right. So, according to the official Jedi uh, tier list at the time of this recording. Uh, in Uber tier, there are the following. Alright, and I'm sorry if I... I'm sorry if, it, if I highly mispronounce any of these names. Because okay. all of these are newer to me. Right. So, there is, um... In the Uber tier, any, uh, uh Hill Ape... Annihilate. Uh, fighting ghost type. Annihilate. That's a new evolution Annihilate. they have for Primate. Oh, okay. Uh, Chine Pow, uh, Dark Ice type. Yep. Uh, T.U., uh, Dark Fire type. Yep, that is another one of those, uh, four Treasures of Ruin Pokemon. Yep, two of those are the Treasures of Ruin. Uh, let's stop, uh, uh let's it's uh, Spathrite. Right. Yeah, Spathrite. I, think, I yep. think it has a really good ability. I think that's what it is. One of its moves is really good. Oh god, it has Speed Boost and Opportunist. One of the two. Whichever one of those is better. Um, I'm guessing this is a... I think this is like an alternative uh, evolution for Mischievous looking at the image, but uh, Flutter main? Paradox Pokemon, but close enough. Paradox Pokemon, okay. Uh, there's also Houndstone. Yeah, I heard some people have some good strategies with that one. I think it's Fluffy ability um, gives it some good moves. Or good defense. Something like that. Probably. Yeah, uh, I'm guessing this is also either a Paradox Pokemon or an evolution of a previous Pokemon. Uh, Iron Ball, which is Ice Water. Yeah, I'm pretty sure so it's it Paradox It looks like it... Yeah, because it looks similar to, uh, frickin', uh, Delibird. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the up. That's why I say that. Uh, then the the two cover legendaries. Yeah, that's not surprising. And they're both dragons. Uh, yeah, that and figures. Yep. Uh, Palfin in both forms. Yep, and there's your Palfin. That was the one I was talking about last time. Because of Palfin's yep. ability, basically, the hero form is... Oh, monster. Yep. So that's the Uber tier. Basically, won't let you use them because they're broken yep. as fuck. I have heard apparently Annihilate is terrifying as well. I know Palvin's uh, bad. Probably because. You... So, probably because of either. If I had to guess, either Vital Spirit or Inner Focus. Or no, oh. not Inner Focus. Final Spirit or Defiant. One of the two. Because Inner Focus... Actually, no. Inner Focus, um... Not only prevents, uh... Because they buffed that, actually. In later generations. Uh, oh. where... Instead of just... Not only do you not flinch... You're attacking races. By one yeah. stage. When you would have flinched. Yeah. So... That's what we'll do as to why it's, uh... Freaking Uber. Defiant is probably it. You lower its stat, its attack goes up by two stages. Oh, God! That's mm -hmm. probably part of why. Its attack's already pretty high. Oh, by the way, we're battling Misty. She starts yep. over the Quagsire to throw you off in case you use an electric type. 
Yep. Yeah, if you have a grass type, they get a good bit of use in Kanto. Yeah, they were seen as arguably the best type to have throughout a lot of the Kanto gyms. At least until later on. Yeah. Because they can survive the first two, and they're good for the last one. A little different case for this generation, but that's beside the point. Yeah. But she definitely upgraded her team. She's got mm. fucking Lapras. Oh, God! Yeah. Uh, so, for these other ones, uh, in the OU, there's Amoongus, Arm Arog, Zimmerel, Rex Caliber, Prelum, Sir, okay, yeah. Uh, Sir Ledge. Yep, Sir Ledge is uh, one of Cinderace. the... Yep. Oh, so, oh, right, they had, uh, Cinderace as one of the Terror Raids, that's right. Yeah. I'm surprised Cinderace is this low, considering it's hidden ability. Yeah, well, other abilities introduced in Gen 9 have been upgraded and probably made it not look as good. Well, well, the hidden ability for Cinderace is, hey, remember, remember the, um, the Froakie line hidden ability? Yep. It's that again. Yep. Yep. Oh yeah, I remember. Fucking funny thing. In the uh, Pokemon anime when uh, Ash fought Leon. Leon had a Cinderace. Guess what its ability was? <laughs> it had Libero. <laughs> yep. Pikachu thought he was going to beat Cinderace and then Mudshot comes in. Yep. Uh... Uh, Claude Sire is also on there. That's a oh, little God, surprising. Was... Oh, could be because of no, unaware. I... No. No. Water board. Oh, gets rid of its water weakness. Ooh. Well, Vegas, hey, you know what to do. And it's a good setup, you can keep it fucking stealth rock, of course. <laughs> yep. Uh, Corviknight? Could be because of its mirror uh, armor ability. Uh, probably. Uh, Cyclizer. Probably because of that skin. Yeah, she had skin, I'd imagine. Or Regenerator, one of the two. Yeah. Actually, yeah, probably she had skin. Or Regenerator! Right. Yeah. Don Dozo. Yeah, it's a weird big fish Pokemon. It's surprisingly good. Yeah. It's like a Snorlax in the yeah. water. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a Dragapult. Now we're into the pseudo legendaries. I mean, these feel obvious. I would think if I hear that one. Dragonite. Of course. Dark up. Not surprising. Uh, Garganthal? Uh, Garganackle, I think it is. That's the final form of that, uh, yeah. that Nackley Pokemon. Basically, salt. Okay. <laughs> it's uh, slow, but it's a strong, tough, rocky bastard. Roll Dango? That's the evolved form of, uh, you know those, uh, Gimme Ghouls, the, uh, treasure chest Pokemon? Yeah. You basically collect 999 of the Gimme Ghoul token material. Give it to a Gimme Ghoul, it'll evolve into a Gold Dango. Its special attack okay. is really fucking high. And its ability is immune to status moves! Yeah. Oh, fuck! Glimora. Yup, that's the prime Pokemon of a certain trainer. Yup, that's... It's got Toxic Spike Drop as its ability, basically. Toxic Debris, yeah. Yep. Although, it's his ability Corrosion's not nothing to uh, snuff at. Yeah, it can be pretty useless. Pretty useless. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Great Tox. Oh, yeah, that's the, uh, that's the Scarlet Paradox form of that, because I think the, I think Violet has another one. 
Uh, photosynthesis is his ability. Whoa, oh, right. That that's a thing that a lot of the, uh... That's the thing that a lot of the, uh, Paradox Pokemon have. There's an item you get, basically you can, like, boost a lot of their power when they use certain moves. Or boost a lot of their stats. Yep. Alright, Greninja? Not surprising. Uh, uh... Uh... Adarine. I'm surprised that one's there. Oh, maybe that's why. It's ability. Is What is it? Magic Bounce? Magic Bounce. Oh god. Yeah. What a guess. You would reflect Spike, Stealth Rock, and Sticky go. Web? What? Yep. Whoa. God damn. Yeah, that's what Jeff does. Oh fuck. That's hey, a pretty oh, good that's ability. Cute. That's cute. You're gonna put hazards on me? Bitch, please. Good lord. That's actually a pretty good ability. God damn. Wow. Yeah, Hydreigon. Oh, of course. Pseudo Legendary. Iron Moth. Another Paradox Pokemon. Anything you see with, like, iron in it, or looks like something from the past, it's a Paradox Pokemon. Alright, Iron Fred. Ah, oh, that's the Don Fan one from the, uh, Violet. Right. Okay. Iron, uh, uh Valiant. Ah, okay. Uh, uh... King Gambit? Yeah! By the way, one of its abilities. Supreme Overlord! They have their power multiplied by one times... Point... Times... One times... It's multiplied by basically... Double or more, where X is the total number of times any Pokemon has fainted on the user's side. Maybe you said this out late. How many Pokemon you lost? Its attack power can basically double. Or can go up by up to one and a half times by the end of the battle. For every yeah. move, no matter what. Yeah, right. Um, yeah, Scara, oh, of course, because... They put that ability on it now. Protean. Oh, Greninja. Yep. Oh. Greninja ability. Wow, that figure. Force Worm. Oh, uh. Oh, Earth Eater. Okay. Makes them need ground do? type moves that can recover from them. So it's like Water Absorb. I'm not Oh, okay. But for ground type. And because uh, of steel type, it's useful. Yeah. I'll do it. Um, Long Moon. Oh, God. Oh, right, that's the fucking Salamence one. Oh, God, I remember that. Fighting that yep. fucking sucked. A Rotom Watch form, because of course. Right. Uh, this one on here, uh, Samurott? That was another one that was, um, uh, Terror Raid. Mm. It's easily strong. It does have shell armor, so you can't critically hit it. There's that. Okay. Uh, Skull Dryer, so final evolution of the, uh, Firestar. It does have unaware as its hidden ability, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Uh, Slow King, I'm surprised to be on here. Uh, like, yeah. did they buff like, own temple? Did they, like, buff, like, own temple or something? Yep. You can't be confused, and you don't get affected by Intimidate, either. That's neat. Uh, Sing Lu. Another one of the dark treasures. Uh, Torkoal, I'm surprised, to be, is on here. Torkoal? Huh. I mean, it has Drought and, like, Stella. Well, Drought is now one of its default abilities instead of a hidden ability. It gets a hidden ability. Oh, that's why. It's new hidden ability, Shell Armor. 
Oh, same thing that Samrod has. No critical hits. And because it's already a tank... Well, Samrod always had... Well, Samrod always had Shell Armor as his hidden ability, but... Yep. I'm surprised that it's even up this high because of that. Yeah, that is true. Uh, Opec. Yeah, I guess that won't be decent. Alright, but, but why is that up here? I guess it's good for defense? Maybe? Yeah. Like, what does Merciless do? Basically, oh, I just looked at it. Basically, the target is poisoned, every hit is critical. Oh, shit. You, know, you poison it, and then you just fuck it up, critically hit, hit every time. So poison, well, that's the way to do it. Poison and then fucking kill them. Its attack stat isn't high, but its defense is, so you can set it up pretty well. Yeah. I'm a little surprised uh, this one's up here. Like, because I'm not used to seeing uh, him up here at all. Typhlosion? Yeah. I mean, I get the flash fire ability because it's like, oh, you get hit by a fire boost. Hey, guess what? My attack's increased by one stage. I mean, but I'm surprised. I'm just surprised that it's up here. Could at be all. his move pool, perhaps. Probably. Uh, Volcarona. Yeah, Volcarona's still pretty decent. Definitely stats and move pool. For that mm -hmm. one. Uh, Walking Wake. That was one of the, uh,. One of the event um terror raids they they've like I wanna say around like February or March. It well, looks like a weird version of Sweet Tree. Paradox Pokemon. Yeah. And then there are uh, his uh the He's we and The Legends version. Yes, 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 the one from Pokemon Arceus Legends, yep. That illusion thing can always fuck people up if they're not ready for it. Mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, Borderline um, UU uh, has Iron Hands and Iron Leaves. Huh, okay. Right, those are the, uh... Yeah, those are more Paradox Pokemon. Right, 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 right. Yep. Uh, in Yu Yu, there's, uh, Aloma for the Generation 5 heart fish thing. Oh, Aloma Mola, yeah, that weird fish thingy. Yep, yep, I remember it. Yeah, when, when I first saw that, I thought that was an evolution of Love Disc. <laughs> I mean, come on. It had all trappings. I know. It Poor really shape. It really should have been. Cause Love Disc continues to be like one of the worst Pokemon still. Yep. Pokemon Company rocks by this. They really should give Love Disc a They haven't even had a Mega Evolution or anything. What are you gonna do? Make the heart bigger? Make like another heart growing yeah, out of the heart. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, Bisharp, Bramble Gas, Decidueye. Another one that came from Terra, I think. Of course. Yeah, Thanksgiving, Perseus, Delayed, Gastrodon, Gengar. I just wonder if they changed its ability for Gengar. Yeah, I don't think it has a. Levitate anymore. It has cursed body. Levitate. Yep. Uh, let's see. Uh, Graf Fi Eye. Graf. Oh, Graf Fi Eye. Okay, that thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you can get Prankster. Yep, Prankster. Grim yeah. Snarl. I can. I can see that because also Prankster. Yep, Gen 8. Gyarados? Does the you know, Moxie, get, I'd imagine. And get Moxie? Oh god, that fucking- Oh, no! 
That explains a bit. Hello, Jeff. Yeah. I'm gonna go the mold breaker. Or unburned. If it loses its held item, its speed doubles. Oh god. Or limber is no, nice. Why? Give it like. So when you say lose a held item, like that includes like items that are like a one use thing on it. So like a berry or like um or something like toxic or flame orb. If this Pokemon loses its held item for any reason, its speed is doubled as long as it remains active. Damn. There's also limber. Yeah, that would do it. Yeah. There. Uh hacker. Yeah, it's still a pretty decent dragon type. Its attack is pretty fucking yeah. high. Yep. Ooh, and rivalry. There we uh, go. Yep, the out on. Yeah, it's surprisingly decent if it even though it's slow. Yeah, iron uh uh jugulus, the hydragon version. Iron jugulus. Oh god! Oh no, that could be bad. Oh god. Could be. Yeah, and then there's Iron Thorns, which is based looks looks like that version of um Tyranitar. Okay, I think I have heard of that one being terrifying, yep. Uh low kicks. Yeah, there's that bug thing you see of all you'll see it a lot later on if I remember correctly. Um, I'm guessing because of, uh, Tinted lens, lens? Yep, basically it's not very effective? Yeah, it is. It's double damage now. What? Mm-hmm. Now it's normal. Fuck! Uh, Lucar yeah, Lucario. Of course. Oh my god, they got that in the back? Steadfast is usually pretty good. Or justified, one of those two. Yeah, well, Interbook is because it got buffed. I would imagine that'd be more of the reason. Oh, uh, Interfocus is still good, too, yeah. A lot of things have been seen beginning yeah, to Inter intimidate. Yeah, basically, Interfocus is that now your attack can't be lowered and you don't get flinched. And anytime you would get flinched, your attack goes up. Yup. Of course. Magnus, I'm surprised it's even up that high. Uh, it does have Magna well, Power and Analytic. I'd say more because of 30. Because Magna Pool basically says, Oh yeah, you're a Steel type, guess what, you're not leaving. Oh yeah, right. I guess it wouldn't be that useful. Mostly. Yeah, yeah that's situational on death. Uh... Mouth... Mouth hold... Uh... Both it's normal and it's four form? Oh, I think it's the evolution. It has like two different forms, technically, but they don't change at all. It's just it has different forms. That's it. They're basically the same Pokemon. I went over that with you before. Yeah. Mimic you. It, it has its move that can basically do right. up to ten hits, and it has Technician. Oh, you're in for trouble. Yep, Technician. That's why. And there's Mimic you. Yep. Noise turn. Yep. Uh, Paul Mott. Basically, your full evolution of the uh, Pikachu clone. It's fighting. Yep. It, it's fighting an electric. It's pretty good. Yeah. Oh, I can't know why it's even in UU. Iron Fist. Yep. And you get a lot of punching moves, including its signature yep. move, Double Shock. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Helper. That's a little surprising. Helper's up there. Yeah. Because of Rain Dish, maybe? Probably because of. I think it's probably because of Move Pool, honestly. Either that or they, they buff, like, uh, Keen Eye. Maybe. It ignores us. It does evasiveness. Have... Oh, shit. Okay. Wow, so no matter how they high your evasion is. Yep. So, yep, no matter how high your evasion is, Keen Eye will still track you. God damn. Damn. Well, then I get all fast drizzle with one of the abilities, too. Right. 
Uh, Pulky guys in uh, both forms. Probably because of Curse Body. Right, probably. Quagsire. I mean, I guess. We know the reason. He's unaware or water absorb. Let's be real. Yeah, one of those two, uh, probably. Uh. Quavel? Yeah, that's the full version of. full evolution of the water starter. Although it can get Moxie. That's yep. Ability. Uh, Rotom Heat. Right. Uh, Salamance. Of course, Moxie. Uh, Sandy Shock. Oh, yeah, that was a weird one. I forgot about Sandy Shocks. That thing's weird. Yeah. Scissor. Technician. Of course. You're all technician. Green Tail. I've heard that thing's actually surprisingly good, if you know what you're doing with it. Yeah. Leatherwing. Another paradox. A raptor. It does have reckless. Yeah. I I know why. Gale wings. Yeah. Uh. Poros in its uh, Paldea forms, uh, Aqua and Blaze. I keep forgetting there are alternate Tauros forms in that region. It's really weird. Uh, Tinkaton? Oh, Tinkaton. Yeah, I, I had that problem with my main team. It's actually pretty decent. Yeah. Because it has a be cool. it has big signature move, Gigaton Hammer. Okay. Toads are cool. Yep. It has stats moves that ignore certain abilities of other Pokemon as its ability. Mycelium might. Serena. So, probably either Queenly Majesty or, um,. Well, I want to say either leaf, like leaf guard, maybe I don't know. Queenly Majesty, Queenly Majesty is the move. Do. Basically, you try to use a oh po priority moves used by the opposing Pokemon basically can't be used. That's right, they're prevented. That's Queenly Majesty. Uh, shit. I remember we looked. Oh at shit, that that yeah. That, that yeah. Uh, Tyranitar and uh, Woe Shine. Ah, uh, the last of the the ruined Pokemon. Yep. Wow, we really just spent the whole episode going over that tier list. Then again, not much happened. We beat Misty, and then we just explored. Yep. That's the only thing that kind and of sucks about Legend Kano. In between all the gyms, there's not that much to do. I think we did get the uh, expansion card, the XPN card. So now we can basically use... Yep. Um, we can go more radio stations, and we have one that includes the Pokey Flute. Would you guys remember seeing that Snorlax when we first got to Vermilion City? We can finally move that fucking fat fuck. Yep. But yep, there you go. Pokemon tier we'll list. Into... Yeah, which we will get into the rest of that list and that is next time. If there is even more of that list. Well, I guess there's like everybody else who's just not concerned much of anything. <laughs> there's the rarely used and then the um the never use. That that's all that's left. Basically everybody else. <laughs> all right. Well, come back next time, and we That's might go after Snorlax. Yeah. We might explore more. I don't know. Oh, yeah, and there's also the PU tier list, but again, that's that's something we will get into. Like I said, there's more of this we'll get into next time. Oh, God. All right, well, I guess see you guys then for more priority list stuff. See you then. I mean, tier list. God damn it.